Hey, welcome back. This is Daryl Kukan with Kukan and Clark Partners. Glad you could join us. We're out here on Shenandoah and Lakeside, and uh, we just picked this property up as a short sale. Um, let's take you on a quick walkthrough. This place is an absolute nightmare, but uh, we love nightmares because nightmares mean money. So let's take you through. So really quiet, really nice neighborhood. Uh, the lake is only two uh, about two to three blocks. You got to walk down and then back up around the back side of the house, uh, down the street. We're talking uh, maybe a 10 minute walk, it's really nice. But these places, what happens is, um, this particular house is where the sellers uh, ended up at drug rehab and uh, of course didn't pay the mortgage. Um, so it went into a short sale, they were a day away from leaving and short sale Jay went ahead and chased him down and I was able to convince them to work with us. So. I would take you in through the front door, but everything's boarded up right now, uh, and we went ahead and did that. Now what happened with that was uh, the city kept putting fines on us once a month, and in order to avoid the fines, we had to go get it cleaned up, but we're not going to spend any money on the property until we know that we can buy it. So as soon as we had the short sale approval, that's when we went ahead and we cleaned up the outside. And we will show you any, everything that's in the garage is what was cleaned up from the outside. So it doesn't look too bad here. In fact, uh, this pool is going to be a really nice area, really nice, um, really nice for a family. So we have an outdoor shower, and uh, this is going to be lots of windows around on this side here. So it's going to be a nice big slider door, lots of windows. We also have an outdoor bathroom here, which uh, out in Lakeside it gets really hot. So with the pool, you're definitely going to want something uh, outside here. So we're gonna redo this a little bit, not much. Keep a lot of it the same. Keep the, the wood the same. So let's let the light adjust here for a second. Now, uh, I'm five foot 10. You're at eye level right now, so you can tell how much junk is in just the garage by itself. It's pretty bad. Um, a lot of the plumbing's been disconnected. The water heater, of course, disconnected. <clears throat> and we are starting this project on uh, Thursday as far as uh, that goes. We're also having a rehab subgroup here on the property on Thursday, March 22nd. We're going to about 30 to 40 other investors out. Take a look at what we're doing. So here we're taking this out. We're opening it up because of the front door. We're flip-flopping the front door. And uh, that way it opens the other way. So as you come in. You've got the family room or living room right in this area. We're going to end up putting wood floors throughout the entire downstairs. Downstairs, three bedrooms and two bathrooms. We're going to remove this wall that's right in here by the kitchen. And uh, again, all these cabinets, we're going to rearrange the entire kitchen. We're bringing a Feng Shui expert in to help us uh, design the home so it flows a little better. So we come down the hallway. And here's your one bathroom, typical bathroom. Again, we're putting uh, travertine floors, travertine walls, light fixtures, vanities, typical stuff. And the bedrooms here are carpet, paint, uh, mirrored closet doors. And we're getting new windows all the way around. So we come through here. Again, it looks like the other bedroom you just saw. It's pretty hard to see because there's no power in here. Same thing, there's in here. Uh, you'll see it on the next video that I, that I show you, the bathroom. But there is a, a bathroom in this room here. Technically, it's the downstairs, you know, master guest, I guess you could say. But the cool part about this, so we have an extra 496 square feet that has not been permitted. And that is right up there, up those stairs. So, with the city's help, with a few uh, uh, paperwork shuffle, we should be able to turn this into, um, from a 1,500 square foot, to a 2,000 square foot home. Add a lot of value for a little bit of money. So again, that's, uh, that's the big uh, windows and doors that are going out to the, the pool area. Again, this place is a wreck. We're gonna f do a little half pony wall right up here. Put a little granite there, that way they can still see the outside. We're gonna move these, uh, these joists, move them up to the, to the top of the ceiling if we can. And as I take you upstairs here, this is where the master bedroom and master bathroom is. So really this does have 
three bedrooms and four bathrooms. It's pretty cool. So at the top of the stairs, we're going to be removing this wall, make a little bigger landing area for this space because, again, we're taking that out. And uh, you can see this bathroom is pretty thin. You know, you're talking with a chair here, you can kind of get an idea of how wide it is. Not very wide. The toilet's right by the front door. We're moving it back to this side over here, <clears throat> pushing the vanity back towards the door. And then we're getting rid of uh, this sort of half shower tub kind of weird thing. I don't know. Nonetheless, oh, all the tiles coming out too. So and it's a pretty big, pretty big master bedroom. I like it. We're also taking this whole space here. We're moving it over about a foot. And that space is actually the closet. So from there, we're going to open, uh, open the bathroom up a little, make it a little bigger. We're not going to lose much room in the master, ba uh, master bedroom. And we're also going to be putting some bigger windows in here, make it nice and bright. What's really nice is the views that you get. So it's a pretty good, pretty good home for a rehabber. So that is it for today. Keep coming back and joining us to watch the progress on this house. It's going to be a fun one. Give us a call, 1-800-77-HOW-TO, or visit us on the web, www.kookinandclark.com. Thanks for joining. See you next time.